So, <clears throat> good evening. It's Juneteenth. And I don't know what kind of holiday everyone could be having, but I guess we're all making the best of it. So, if you have access to the barbecue grill or even some small celebration, enjoy. But, um, right now, I'm not doing anything. I'm sitting here and I'm just meditating on salvation. And as a Christian, you know, I, I consider myself, when I say Christian, you know, not a citizen of a Christian nation, you know. But I, I consider myself someone that has confessed Jesus Christ as Savior, according to the Bible definition of Christian. But I'm sitting here and I feel like God is literally going through my body, my private part. And I'm asking, why would you do that? What are you doing? And I have no answer. I have no reply. But what would give him the right to do that? Knowing that they're going to classify me as a mentally ill person if I if I say that. But I have contacted just several high-profile people, and I want to talk. I want to talk about it openly, and and I wanted to run the gamut. And I don't know who will be willing to talk with, talk with me about it. How, but I did ask the mayor, our, our local mayor, would she speak with me? I did ask a one high profile person from a church I used to attend. Um, she's over one of the very, very um, well known programs at the church that ministers not only to women in the church, but women outside of the church. Um, and, and even now, I feel like God's going to talk about it, but this is just the tip of the iceberg. I cannot begin to describe what I'm dealing with personally. I cannot begin to describe it. And I wonder what gives him the right to do something like that. And he, he just keep going from bouncing around. He just keep bouncing around. You know, he's first he's telling me that there's a white woman that wants to answer a black man's response to her. Saying that she killed him when he meet her. Unless he's saying something about me, so he says something horrifying. And, and a way for her to let me know that he's saying something horrifying about me is to dig in my private parts. To me, that's the first thing. He just keeps jumping around. Then he says something about some black woman. And, and when I say woman, he's a defining woman as a, a teenager, a child that's sexually active, all the way up until adulthood. Is listening to me talk and mimicking it and saying that when she do that, she meets somebody. But it said it has caught the white woman's eye. And asked, she asked them why they want to do that because I have no value. So on top of all of that, she's touching me in my body and, and saying something. I don't know what, what she's saying to them. You know. So on top of all that, I'm dealing with all of these things. And so I'm trying to find some people who will talk with me about that. So I'm, I'm going to see who all I can get.